Today on Brew Review, we have the Barrel Aged Peach Sour Nova by Almanac Beer Company out of Alameda, California. This is a sour ale aged in oak barrels with peaches, nectarines, and vanilla beans coming up next. Welcome to Brew Review, I'm Brady. And I'm Corey. If you're new to the channel, Please subscribe and ding the bell to be notified of all the fresh brewed content coming your way. We have the Peach Sour Nova. This is about to be explosivo. What does that mean? I don't know. All I know is that this is farm to barrel with the peaches and nectarines. This one was given to us from Clinton Gourmet Corp out of New York, New York, and is absolutely fantastic for them to send us this stuff. Thank you guys. The Peach Sour Nova is coming in at 5.8% ABV. Not sure of the IBUs on this one. This is not kettle sour. This is barrel aged. This is the real deal, guys. It's a mixed culture ale. Very excited about this one. It's one of my favorite styles. Let's start off by looking at this can. Beautiful colors going on. A bunch of bubbles in the background. Very futuristic space age kind of feel to it. It pops, dude. It pops. The Albanac logo, NASA-esque of them. We got tart, refreshing, real fruit as descriptors. Let's look at the beer, man. Kind of a hazy milky boy. Nice golden yellow. A bit of paleness around the edges. Just kind of creamy, almost like lemonade. Just the slightest amount of lacing going on there, just like a ring. Did have some head going on when we first poured it. Yeah, a bit of head, but I mean, that's, that's you know, it's fairly not really common that it just not really, not really much head retention on this one. No, no, they never really do. Let's smell it. Yeah. Oh, it's got the uh, ascetic punch right in your face. A little barnyard wet horse blanket. Juicy nectarine smell. A little butter as well. Are you getting cream corn? I don't know about the corn, but there's a definitely creaminess to it. That I would probably associate with some you know? corn, but yeah. Definitely get a little bit of vanilla, nice stone fruit. I feel like I'm getting definitely more nectarine than I am peaches with it. it smells amazing. Looks pretty great. Yeah. So why don't we taste it? Definitely more peachy on the flavor. Bite of tang in the back. Some skier. It's got the peach flavor, but the nectarine juiciness. It kind of stays in your mouth, that, that vanilla is at very much at the end. That's tart. That's super tasty. That's nice. A little bit of biscuitiness at the end as well, little table crackers. And you know, maybe that's what it is. I think I was getting like this aftertaste of like this just woodiness, mm -hmm. but maybe it's more of a, you know. Biscuit quality. Biscuit table cracker. Oh man, you definitely get that nectarine. Just bright and crisp and refreshing. Citrus zest, that lemon peel. The nectarine is a little bit responsible for the mouthfeel too, giving it that juicy, that juicy quality. Light bodied, but at the same time, just a blast of flavor. Um, very acidic um, and, and tangy mouthfeel. You can tell that it's brewed with real peaches and real nectarines. This isn't fake stuff. I really like this. I'm gonna say it's not my favorite of this style, but I really enjoy it. I think I'm gonna go for 4.5. That beautiful, refreshing tanginess uh, that I really look for. I would maybe would like to see a little more of the peaches come through, but um, it easily could just be, be the can that we got. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a 4.4. I love this, really, I really do. It's mm -hmm. very crushable. I mean, I could probably drink two of these. If you're into sours, this is something you should definitely look into. So that was our review of the Barrel Age Peach Sour Nova by Almanac Beer Company. Pretty good overall. Really enjoyed that one, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. If you liked what you saw, please like the video, subscribe, ding the bell to be notified of all the new content coming around. Let us know what you thought. Have you had this beer? Have you had anything else from Almanac? We'd love to hear about it, guys. Until next time, cheers. cheers.